You're welcome. Today we'll be looking at how to download and install Microsoft 365 apps using Office Deployment Tool. So the first thing you do is to go to your browser and search for Office Deployment Tool. Then you download it. You click on the link, sorry. Um, when the link opens, you scroll down. Yeah. So you see the download button. You click on it. Yeah. So we wait for it to... I won't be able to click on it because I already have it downloaded. But for new um, users that want to download, you just click on it and it will download. Then you go to your downloads and look for the, the, the file and then extract it. So I'm going to check for it. So in my downloads now, if I click on downloads, I will see it there. Hold on. Okay. Yeah, so let's wait while I system is a bit slow. Okay, there it is. Then you click on that. So when you click on it, you'll be able to um, you, you check. It asks you to agree. You agree, and then you continue. So when you continue. You, you now go and save it. You save the, the file in your C drive. Make sure you save it in the C drive. It's easier that way. So you, in the C drive, you make a new folder there and uh, name it ODT. That's how it works. Yeah, you make a new folder and name it ODT. Okay, then you, you save it. So once that is done, hold on, I'm trying to do that. Here the name. Okay, and name it ODT. So it's quite simple. Okay. Uh, hold on, let's. Uh, I'm trying to multitask here. <laughs> so. So there it is, it's saved in the C drive. I'm trying to close these tabs so that it doesn't confuse. So now um, the next thing will be to go to your browser again, go to the Office Customization tool. Uh, the link is uh, config.office.com. You type it there, config.office.com. So it will load the Office Customization tool. With this customization tool, you'll be able to select um, the the language okay there it is it's up so you don't sign in don't click on sign in. just go scroll down you see create you click on the create yes you click on create okay so here uh, so on this um, on this uh, office customization to um, site here you'll be able to customize your choices for the um, the new office apps you can choose your language here yeah, you can choose um the the uh, the office subscription whether it's apps for enterprise or apps for business here yeah, you can choose um the version this is whether 62 bit or 32 uh, 64 bit or 32 bits you can choose a whole lot of your preferences here so this is a very important aspect of um of your download you can also choose your update channel um, you can choose um, so many things, you know. So as you scroll down, you see the options. You make your choices. So once you are done with this section, um, you click on export. Okay, you click on export by your upper uh, right. You see it there. So once you click on that export, you should be able to. You have it in your downloads. And uh, the name uh, will be configuration. Don't change the name. Leave it as configuration. The name of the file configuration you export it and you have it in your downloads so i'm unable to do that because i already have this thing that i want to conflict in my device so um the next thing to do will be to move the configuration file that you see in your downloads you move it and paste copy it and paste in the odt folder in your c drive so you open the c drive where you have the odt folder and paste it there okay so once you have done that we'll move on to the next step so here you open the command prompt as an admin, an administrator. So you change, um, okay, hold on, it's coming on. Yeah, so you change directory to your the C drive where you saved your ODT. You type CD, okay, hold on, CD, 
give space and then change directly to the C drive. C drive. Hold on, okay. Yeah, yeah. There you go. There you go. Okay. coming on yes so here we are in the c drive we also change directory uh, in the c drive to the odt folder okay change directory odt and enter there you go so here now you now run the the configuration file we, we downloaded um, from the config.office.com you write setup setup.ese give space forward slash download this will download all the office apps into your device download uh, then give space configuration use the same uh, 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 you know the, the configuration is in capital letter because that's how you should get it when you download the configuration file from uh, config.office.com so you write some um, configuration uh, remember to put dot, dot sml because um, that's the file type sml configuration.sml so when you, once you're done with this you run it so well, I, I won't be able to run it because i don't want confliction so once you run this um, you'll be able to you you can go to the odt folder and check you see a new folder will be created there called office that will show you that um, office apps have been downloaded okay so once this is done it will return back to or uh, to uh, the, to stop blinking and um, you see the C drive ODT will open again. Then you you type the new code. Uh, this one will now apply the configuration settings to the apps that are download uh, that, that are downloaded. That one is setup.ese um, forward slash configure. Then configuration.sml. Once you run this final code, the Office apps will now be fully configured. And after that, you have your apps. Then you launch any of the apps and activate with your credential. And be able to enjoy your office apps on your device okay i hope this is helpful if you have any question you can drop them on the comment section i'll be glad to assist bye